What's up guys, Tao here. Uh, today I will give you a very quick update or follow-up video on this iPad Air 2. It runs on the iOS 13.3 now, so at this the very early stage of beta. Just bear in mind, uh, now this is just a very quick video to show you what's the early stage like on the, the new iOS 13.3. Uh, now, all in all, um, it's kind of a mix uh, performance. On a day-to-day -day task, is okay, but I did notice there are dramatic lags when you open cer certain applications, especially when you have a few apps open at the same time. Um, otherwise, it was okay in a way, um, but compared to the iOS 13.1 or uh, compared to the iOS 13.2, now the point three right now, uh, bear in mind it's still on the early stage, it's performed badly compared to the previous two, the biggest drawback so far I've seen is on the battery. Now the iOS 13.3 is killing the battery. I did use the Geekbench to test it. Um, in terms uh, from 100 to 1% with 50% dim, it lasts almost, almost two hours less than the iOS 13.1 and 2. To me, it's a big deal. Now, there might be a sign of the new system or the new iOS is gonna finally clean the iPad Air 2 off, maybe in the future update, but we don't know yet. This again is early stage. I really, really hope the 13.3, the final release, is gonna be optimized for the older device like the iPad Air 2. Otherwise, it's gonna be sad to see this five years old iPad Air 2 finally gone. There's some apps when you open them it take I feel like it takes twice as long especially the big apps or the games um, the games um, the what well, the game I use is Call of Duty the mobile version it did take as twice long as the upper OS 13.2 and 1 um, yeah it, it just the performance is struggling a bit but other than that um, in terms of the day-to-day -day tasks you feel might be okay, but again, the battery is biggest drawback on the new iOS 13.3 beta at the moment. Now, bear in mind, this is the very, very early stage of the 13.3. I can't emphasize on enough. This is the very early stage. I really hope the final, the final version, or maybe the late on the beta 2, 3, 5, maybe 7, is gonna optimize for the old hardware. Honestly, I sincerely hope Apple is going to keep supporting old hardware. They've been doing pretty well. I know it's really, really old, but it has still a lot of life left in this iPad Air 2 um, and also other old iPad as well. If you guys are um, wanting to see my follow-up videos on this iPad Air 2, especially for you guys who actually own the iPad Air 2, please uh, click on the like and the subscribe. And so I will be keep doing this kind of follow-up video. Um, maybe not every single beta, but if the beta is significant enough, I will do a follow-up video on that particular OS. Just give you guys a heads up if you want to upgrade or if you want to stay away or maybe just buy a new iPad. Or change to something else all right this is the very very quick video on the iPad Air 2 with the very very beginning of the iOS 13.3 see you guys in the next one